Hello, Cancer. This is your June 2018 reading. Hopefully it's a good one this time for everybody. I mean, I've been getting so, you know, i got to read them what the cards say. I don't know how these other readers are getting all these positive readings of love every month, but there's just not love every month for everybody. And remember, this reading may not resonate with all Cancers. So, Cancer, June 2018. It's your turn. Someone's been requesting it, too, for cancer, so I thought I'd get it out. Cancer, June 2018. Cancer, June 2018. Cancer, June 2018. Ugh. Oh. Pedro Oops. Four of Swords in the upright, someone's holding back. Could be feelings, you know, finances, whatever. Someone's holding back something. That's the beginning energy. Could be a love situation because you got the Ace of Cups in reverse. Someone's holding back on their love. They don't want to put their love out there. Could have to do with the Knight of Wands, which, as you know, can be a... Uh, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, not necessarily in that order. Keep them turned over and make it interesting, huh? But got the Ace of Cups. It's in reverse. It's starting out as a subject. And the Knight of Wands is crossing this love situation. This new passionate beginning you're possibly wanting. Cups or emotional beginning, I should say. Someone's holding back, maybe. Ace of Cups, why are you there for Cancer for June? In reverse with this Knight of Wands. Why is it in reverse? Why are you in reverse? Why is the Knight of Wands crossing you? I'm thinking someone was in want more independence right now because you got the Queen of Pentacles. I mean, it's, it's, the Queen of Pentacles is the mother card at times, along with the um, um, Queen of Cups. But they're also known to, as to be the um, someone who's emotionally stable, thinks things, uh, how can I say it with the Queen of Pentacles? They usually make sound decisions, and it's for the betterment of everybody. And she's probably making the sound decision not to go forward right now as a subject with the Knight of Wands. Someone's holding back, as you know, from the beginning energy. The goal is the Princess of Disc in reverse. This is also an earth element. Like the earth element can be a um, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. And the goal, that's your goal is a princess of disc in reverse. So if you're wanting uh, that as a goal, you may be trying to turn this person around or turn around a, a situation that's not exactly stable for you right now. Or, and this could be vice versa. This could be the energies coming towards you, maybe a person, cross watcher. But princess of, princess of disc, why are you there? Hold them back. Four of Pentacles. Hold them back. Foundation. Queen of Wands. Again, a fire energy. Queen of Wands is in the upright, so someone's trying to work something out. And, um, uh, I would have to say they're, they're a passionate person. They say what they, they, they'd like to talk with all their emotions in it, and they really like to put out that energy, almost in a drama type situation, but not in a bad way because they're in the upright. They're usually pretty good looking. They got a, a good, you know, they, everybody likes being around them. They got this sunshine about them, this energy, but they're there. They're, they're in the foundation. They're in the upright right now, whatever this person is in your life, or maybe this is your energy you're taking on. So why is the Queen of Wands the foundation for cancer? Oops. 
I don't, they're not making a decision. You got them holding back. You got in the beginning them holding back with the Four of Pentacles. Now you got the Two of Swords here. There's someone who's putting up their swords, their blockers, and they're staying blindfolded. I am not making the decision. I am blocking this situation. So someone's holding back, and it could be you, Cancer. Now, in the past, you got the Eight of Cups. It's in reverse. The Eight of Cups is somebody in the upright. Is somebody walking away? It's maybe uh, indulgence. They say indulgence. I always see it as somebody possibly walking away. It could be over an indulgence, but let me see what the other cards say because it could be anything. Eight of Cups. Why are you there in the reverse for cancer? Could be that somebody walked away. Yes, yeah, somebody, somebody, when it's in uh, reverse and there's another negative card attached to it in the past, the death card, is something you walked away from and you don't want to come back to it. And it doesn't mean that you broke up with a person totally. I mean, oftentimes it can be. But it could mean that you're just stopping a certain situation. You're holding back. You're not going back to any more negative situations. It doesn't mean you're not going back to that person. You may say and stop to a negative situation in general. And the Two of Swords, you're going to come out of feeling unblocked. You're going to unblock it in the near future. Right now, the foundation, you're blocking it. In the near future, you're going to put them swords down, possibly, and make a decision. But we don't know. i got to have a clarifying card for that. Sorry. Jump the gun. Two of Swords, why are you in the near future? Yeah, you're not, you're not going to, you're going to not block this situation because it was a, a an unhappy home situation that occurred. So you may be trying to make a decision about your home situation. You're no longer going to keep the blindfold on, as they say. You're no longer going to hold back in the future, in the near future. You may be doing that now, but not in the near future. You're going to make a decision. This is the possible future outcome. And the vice card, someone, it's a two of wands. Someone is making a decision and a forceful one because it's ruled by Mars. Mars is a, a fighting planet. It's not just about fights. It's, it's a energy planet. It's taking on the energy. It's, it's moving forward. It's not, it's making a decision. It's taking, this is also known as the dominance card. You're going to dominate a situation. So why is the two of wands there for cancer? Coming out of sorrow, you're refusing to stay in sorrow. You're making a decision. What is coming towards you, outside influences, could be people, could be just the environment in general. The energy is coming towards you is the Queen of Cups. Now, this could be another uh, water type element like yourself, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. But this is someone, I think it's somebody else because this is an outside environment. And the Queen of Cups, when she's in reverse, she's like kind of emotional, but in a distraught way, not in a good way. You know, emotions can be good and they can be, you know, bad. But this one is 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 maybe putting a damper on your energies. They're saying, you can't do this. They may be really emotional about it and dramatic and they're coming towards you. I don't know. You may know this person. You can put in your comments if you do. I don't know who this person is, but they are outside energy. Queen of Cups, why are you there? Why are you in reverse? And why are you coming towards Cancer? Yeah, they're coming with news that you're not going to like. That's it. They're, they're negative Nancys, as they say. They're, they're, they're going to be negative. You know, here you are. Um, you're holding back, but you want to come unblocked with a, a situation. It may be in a marriage, in a family setting. I'm thinking it's a relationship. You held back before. You walked away. Somebody walked away. Maybe even some of you actually divorced. But in the future, cancer is going to make a decision to come out of sorrow. And you, But you got somebody, a naysayer, coming towards you. And your hopes and fears, your, your hope is for success. And that makes sense. And what you hope for sometimes comes to reality. And it is a, a good card. It's a Six of Pentacles. Why are you there, Six of Pentacles? Let's, let's see what else you're hoping for, some of you. 
Six of Pentacles, why are you there for cancer? Yeah, you're wanting success. Or you're no longer wanting to um, have this Two of Pentacles situation. It's in reverse. So when the Two of Pentacles is in reverse, you're no longer trying to juggle a certain situation you don't like. You're no longer trying to keep things afloat with that. This Maybe that's why you were holding back before, but you're no longer holding back. You're no longer going to be um, trying to contemplate what to do. Um work something out. You just want success. You're no longer wanting to battle this where you can't keep your head afloat. Keep these balls going. These, you know, juggling. And it could be, uh, yeah, change. Two of Pentacles. You got it again. You are not keeping up with this energy. You're not no longer juggling with this situation, with this hold back situation, with whatever, you know, whatever ended. And whatever you were holding back on, you are no longer holding back. You're making a decision. You're coming out of sorrow. You're no longer going to be pondering, juggling two situations that aren't working out for you. You're hoping for success. Let's see if you get it. This is in the first part of June, mostly. Got a lot of pentacles here, so it can go on a little bit further past June. Two of pentacles reverse as the outcome also for cancer. Two of Pentacles reverse. Why are you there as the outcome? Yeah, because you got other options. You got other things going on. You're, you're, you are got this two, like I said, two of Pentacles. You're no longer wanting to juggle this past situation. You're no longer wanting the negativity. You're going to make a decision. You got other options. You may not like those options and you may not go for them. And they're a little bit confusing, so you may hold off on that because you do have some hold back cards in the in the beginning. But you got that seven of cups, and when that seven of the cups is there, that's a confusion card. Maybe you're no longer wanting to do deal with this confusion. That could be it too for some of you. And others may have different options. One more card for the change card, the two of pentacles in reverse with the seven of cups attached. <laughs> Seven of Cups. Why are you all there? Because you know you're not taking any more uh, negativity. That's what it is. You're you're just you're just taking a break from negativity because it's leaving you unbalanced, feeling unbalanced. So that's what's going on with Cancer. Cancer is just uh, before they held back for what they want to say. Like I like I told you in the beginning. And they wouldn't make a decision. They had their swords up. And then in the near future, they put their swords down because of this unhappy situation. They refuse to stay in sorrow. They're making a decision. Ignore the Queen of Cups coming towards you because that is an outside energy. Go for that success like you're hoping for. And just don't juggle a negative situation. And that's it for Cancer. And I'll talk to you later. And uh, hopefully middle June, I'll be traveling. So hopefully I get back to you soon. Bye.